Good morning, madam. Yeah, good morning. Your reason? Your name? Kantishri. Sorry? Kantishri. Kantishri. Okay, Kantishri, how are you? Fine, madam. Okay, where are you from? I am from Andhra Pradesh, East Godavari District, Kamlapur. Okay. Okay, tell me about yourself. Thank you, madam, for giving me this wonderful opportunity to introduce myself. My name is Kantasri. I am from Andhra Pradesh, East Godavari District, Amlapuram. Coming to my graduation, I completed my B.Tech in, uh, in the year of 2022, Kite Engineering College in the stream of CSC. My aggregation is 7 points. And coming to my family, m consists of four, three members, mother, brother and, and me. My mother is a working woman and brother is studying 10th class and me. And my hobbies are to listening music and my... My strengths are uh, too detailed, focused, and too honest, and my uh, weaknesses are uh, forward thinking. Okay. Okay. Uh, what are your technical skills? My technical skills in mainframes. Mainframes. Okay, you are trained on mainframes. Yes, ma'am. Okay. What are data types? Data types are three types uh, numeric, alphabetic, and alphanumeric. Okay. Numeric data type is uh, represents 9 and maximum length is 18 bytes and uh, it represents 0 to 9 and uh, alphabetic is represents uh, uh, A and uh, maximum length is 35,535 bytes mm -hmm. and it uh, uh, it represents A to Z spaces and alpha numeric is a co combination of both numeric and alphabetic and it represents to A to Z and 0 to 9 and uh, maximum length is uh, 35,535 bytes. Okay. What is uh, level number? Level number in COBOL, level, uh, variable declaration is always starts with level numbers. 0, 01 level number is a group element and uh, 0, 02 to 49 is a subgroup element. 77 is a pure independent element and uh, 66 is renames and 88 is a uh, conditional names. What is 01 and 77 level numbers? 0, 01 level number is a group element and it will act as a both a group element and subgroup element. Without 0, 01 level numbers, we can't declare the groups and subgroups. And 77 level number is a group uh, independent element. Uh, we can't declare any groups and subgroup elements. Okay. What is COBOL structure? In COBOL structures uh, starts with divisions, sections, paragraphs, sentence, statements, verbs and characters. What is coding sheet? Coding sheet is uh, represent to store the data and coding sheet 24 rows and 80 columns. Rows are extendable, columns are not extendable. If the rules in coding sheet is 1 to 3 are the page numbers, 4 to 6 are the line numbers and these are the sequential numbers. 7 is the indicator area and A to 11 are the area A will start with division sections and paragraphs and 12 to 72 is uh, area B will start with uh, uh, sentences, statements, verbs and the characters and logics and uh, 72 to 80 are the system defined numbers. Okay. Okay, Kantashri, uh, what is PS and PDS? PS, PS is a physical sequential data set. Uh, in one PS, we can write one program. Uh, uh, directory, uh, PS directory block should be zero and PDS is a partition data set. So we can write number of programs based on the directory block. Directory block should be non-zero and uh, PS directory block formula is 6 and minus 1. Okay, what is justification? How we can assign the values in internally. Numeric is a left right justification and alphabetic is a left justification and alphanumeric also left justification. Uh, what is perform? Performs is a looping uh, looping statements. In performs are to execute the number of statements, logics, and number of times with or without conditions. In performs, uh, advantages are we can reduce the code complexity and manual errors. Uh, in performs are six types uh, simple inline, simple outline, uh, perform n times, perform varying, perform until, and perform through. Uh, in simple inline and simple outline are executes one time, and uh, simple inline in, is uh, uh, sequential flow of execution and uh, sim uh, simple outline is a random flow of executions. In simple inline, we can execute the number of programs within the perform and underperform. In simple outline, we can uh, execute the number of uh, statements and logics must and should be called the performs. And uh, perform and perform anti and perform varying it based on the uh, condition and number of times uh, by using the uh, three statements initializing, uh, condition checking and uh, Incre uh, increment and decrement. Mm. Perform through is uh, based on in between the paragraphs. Okay. Okay. Uh, what are the mandatory divisions? 
mandatory divisions are uh, two two uh, first one is identification division identification division is nothing but to identify the uh, divisions and uh, program id is mandatory and the processor division is mandatory because we can write the logics and statements in processor division okay what is implicit and ex uh, explicit scope terminator in, in implicit scope terminator every every line uh, ends with uh, implicit scope terminator and explicit is uh, nothing but a group of statements ends with uh, explicit scope terminator okay okay kantasri uh, like i am impressed with your answers you have good communication and technical skills we will uh, get back to you okay thank you have a nice day thank you